to this week in my life video. My hair is looking crazy because I just got out of spin class. Oh my gosh. My friend inspired me because she did this TikTok of like all the drinks she has before 1 p.m. And I was like, ooh, that's making me crave the espresso. So I got this and I thought I would do the honors of mixing it up on camera for you guys. Look at how satisfying that looks. I love this drink. Um, it's kind of expensive just because it is espresso, but it's so worth it. It's so good. Very rich. And I went to the really good Starbucks. Like, I think this is my favorite Starbucks one in like Winter Garden area because they always make the drinks so well and they're cheaper. So yeah, I decided to start filming because it's Monday and I said I wanted to start like um, doing week in my life because I don't know. Even, I know some people won't like these because they're gonna be like more longer, but also longer videos seem to do well and it's gonna be kind of repetitive, but I was talking to my one of my friends, Angie, and I'm like, you know what, maybe it will be more relatable because like I don't have a lot going on during the week, especially like when I'm working. So it'll be a lot of footage in the car, but it'll be kind of like a drive with me vibe. So I think that'll be kind of cool and fun and exciting and I'll just like talk about whatever's happening or on my mind or anything like that. Um, I won't actually physically be driving because I don't know, I can't find it. But my car mount like kind of popped off so I'm not going to get another one because like twisting the camera on and everything is just like, I don't know. So this is what we're working with. And I think it's also probably safer as well. And yeah, I'm gonna get to work now. It is about 8.30 and I like to get there like around nine, get the day started. And well, you're we seeing this after the week, but whenever you see this, I hope you're having a good day and on to whatever I film next. Okay, we are back in the car and it's lunchtime. Lunchtime already, man. And right now I'm just finding like candidates' heads, like their headshots. Because we're going to be having to cut those out, which is going to be kind of boring, but it's fine. Um, just going to have my lunch and then get back to work. Day in my life, man. Well, week in my life. It was funny, though, that my um, boss brought in these Cheez-Its and Valerie bought some for herself because they were on sale. So when he brought them in this morning, I'm like, oh my gosh, Cheez-Its are following me. It's a sign. I'm going to have some Cheez-Its after my lunch, most definitely, because <laughs> they just keep reappearing. Also, too, I would typically eat outside, but it's like all rain and stuff, and there's people like at the tables, and... Frankly, I like to be by myself while I eat because I like just zoning out on my phone or whatever, not like talking to people. I know that sounds like antisocial. Not that I don't like people, it's just like, I don't know. It's like my lunch hour, you know? The plus side though, I have been eating in my car more because I don't have to put on headphones because typically I do have headphones on when I'm like working and stuff and wanting to listen to things. But if I'm in here, I can just listen without headphones and like, earbuds so it, there is a plus side to that and air conditioning but right now I don't need air conditioning because it's like rainy and kind of I'm like I'm freezing right now I get cold so fast so it's not that big of a deal to me so yeah I don't know kind of just kind of just eat where I feel like it okay guys so got home and this is my dinner yes I got out the triscuits because I just wanted to eat that but this is my dinner mothers are at Disney Springs I think um, and I'm also watching this really good it's like a documentary style video I love these um, videos because they're nice and long they're good to like listen to but not the good girl has such good videos if you are looking for some like fun stuff if you're looking for some really interesting stuff to watch also too I ordered a book and I'm so excited for it to get here it is called I'm so happy my mother died by Jeanette McCurdy and she goes in to like explain like her childhood being like a child star and stuff so this is what the cover looks like and I will add it to my little Amazon list if you check the link in my description box go to my website and like my Amazon storefronts there this is what the cover looks like it's just like of her 
I really like it. It's I like the colors and stuff, but um, it comes out tomorrow, and I think the book is going to get delivered, like, on the 11th or 12th. Super excited to read that. I might even put off reading about my like my dog book just to read that because I know I can get through this a lot faster than my dog book. Um, I'm more than halfway done with it. It's just like one of those reads that you know I don't read as fast because I'm not like into it as much but I know with her book like I can probably like breeze through it. So I'm really excited about that. Okay so I just packed my lunch. I'll show you guys. I'm seriously like just in my PJs, so looking kind of rough. And it was hair washing night, so basically I wash my hair like twice a week and I normally wash it Tuesday morning, but I have an appointment um, tomorrow, so I just have to like get up and go. I made it pretty early and yeah, so anyway, just wash my hair tonight so I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. So for my lunch, I just put everything here. My like little crackers, vitamins, cookies. I know it's kind of dark, but you guys have seen it. And then in here, I just have my eggs and celery. Celery wasn't that good at the store, so I'm running a little low on that. So I had to like divvy it up in like smaller sections, if that makes sense, for the week, but it's fine. Right now, I'm going to do the thumbnail and schedule my video to go up tomorrow because um, I want to post something on Tuesday. I think I'm going to change up my schedule. I'm not sure. I'm still thinking about it. I love uploading three times a week, but honestly, like... I don't know. I feel like longer videos will just do better. So if I do a weekly vlog and then a weekend vlog, maybe that'll work. I don't know. I'm going to test it out and see. Um, I think I'm going to do that because it'll just be easier to just put all this footage together and like not worry about like this middle, like Thursday, what do I, what am I going to put up? You know what I mean? Like I have no idea. <laughs> So I guess if I have a main channel like or a themed sit down video or get ready with me, that will also, that will be like a bonus video. But right now, like as my schedule progresses and everything, and I feel like my vlogs can be longer and they can just be all around better. I'm thinking I'm going to drop down to two days a week and just make the videos longer. So let me know what you guys think about that and I'm going to get to scheduling. Mother's got home from Disney Hello. Springs. Yes, we did. Do some early Christmas shopping. Yes. We're not having a reveal party though. No, we have to wait till Christmas. We do. Right. Okay, so as you guys know, I have like a little appointment, but first I want to show you guys my outfit. So this is what I'm wearing. Pretty casual Tuesday. Just decided to go with the sweatshirt because it gets cold in the building and I think it's supposed to be a rainy day again today. There's Sherry. Hi, I'm on the green team too today. Oh yes, green. green, green. Obviously Starbucks because that's basically like my breakfast, my habit, so let's go. Okay, so I got my normal beverage. If you guys know my order, it is this, you're looking at it and it's kind of semi affordable not really but i don't like go out to lunch or anything so this is kind of like my treat treat during the day oh my gosh i can't wait to get a dog and be like it was treat treat anyway okay green light gotta go i am done with work there's sherry she's going through mail oh my but i just have my salad, we're doing salads again tonight because Valerie's teaching and stuff. And I think that's it for today. Um, today's portion. On to tomorrow, which Tuesdays, I or Wednesdays, I always typically sometimes, I don't know. Sometimes I don't. But I get up early tomorrow, which is gonna be fun because I go to Jen's class. I love Jen's cycle class. Like, she's awesome, so can't wait for that but i always can like never sleep on tuesdays so i'm gonna try to like go to bed earlier tonight i don't know but it'll be fine it'll be fine <laughs> Okay, it is 5.36 in the morning and I'm getting ready to go into Cycle Bar. So I'm 
listening to the Gals on the Go podcast about the Revolve, um, like what really happens on like the Revolve trip. And it is like really interesting and neat to hear their perspective. So I'm kind of glad that they made that episode. I still stand by like all my opinions that I was saying in the last video I posted. So yeah, but it, it does give me a better insight and everything. Um, this week in the life vlog, I, I like doing because I don't feel like pressured to film. I'm just like filming throughout the week and after I get out of class and like go to Starbucks I do want to talk about like losing followers like now I'm at 13 uh 38.1 and I'm just like this sucks um I wish that like whoever doesn't like watching me just like I wish they just like massively unsubscribe so I don't so I don't see it like just trickle like one well, I'm basically just saying it right now so anyway yeah I'm just gonna get it out now because like why not the lighting's okay, I guess. So my demographic, okay, is like 24 to 30 something. I honestly wish my audience was younger. No offense, guys. Like, I love you, but seriously. Um, I wish it was younger just because, like, I feel like older people are more likely to unsub. And especially because I'm not doing, like, controversial c content, like, about, you know, how bad family vloggers are. But, um, yeah, I'm at 38 um, 1,187, so it's trickling down. I just wish it would just, like, mass, like, I wish it would just, like, mass, go okay, I'll be at 37.4, you know what I mean? Like, I'll just stick at that number, just, like, keep it there or whatever, but, like, just watching it go down, I'm just, like, okay, I'm over this, like, people just unsub, gosh, <laughs> anyway, it's just annoying and uh, kind of discouraging, but whatever. Again, with this channel, like, I do what I want and everything like that, so it's fine, and frankly, like, Instagram is popping off for me, like, I'm getting a lot of engagement, surprisingly, well, not on photos, because, like, I have 12 likes on a photo, but, like, the reels and video content, which does make me feel good, so it is always a balance, because when, um, hey, lighting got better, because this huge-ass truck um thanks dude okay just got a cycle bar as you can tell by the hair and this is matcha lemonade and the girl said it's pretty good like she makes it for herself look at how tiny this little starbucks cup is how adorable this must be like how they serve like if you order just a single shot of espresso i don't really know but i'm gonna try it hopefully i like it mmm wow that is good. The matcha's on the bottom, I think, so. I'm getting most of the lemonade. Mmm. It's like a green tea type of green tea lemonade. But I mean, it is matcha, so that is quite tasty. I really, really like it. All right. Honestly, I want to keep that cup because I think it's cute. <laughs> Not going to lie. But I got my signature espresso drink because on the app it said they were all out, like sold out. So I don't know if they're sold. They weren't sold out of vanilla, so they might have been sold out of almond milk, but I could still order an almond milk latte. So how could Starbucks, how could this Starbucks be out of iced coffee? Like, don't you, I don't know. But I took it as a sign to get this again today. I got it on Monday because it was Monday. But I took it as a sign because I got up at 4.30 today. So might as well get a drink that I know will like help me because always like at the it's like towards the middle of the day I hit this wall you know like oh my gosh I am so tired so I'm glad that I got my espresso drink and yeah anyway gonna enjoy this I kind of just said everything that I wanted to say I know I like complain about that I feel like a lot but you know what this is my channel I can talk about whatever I want to talk about and yeah, that's, I mean, yesterday I was just like, oh my gosh, man. But I want to thank you guys, the ones who, like, stick around and, like, watch my channel and stuff. Because 
it's really nice this girl named natasha like leaves like 700 comments so thanks girl like it helps my but sometimes i don't read like what you're saying like i don't know the tone so it's like uh are you being like a smart ass or something but anyway <laughs> like i don't know because you don't leave like any emojis so i don't know how to take it but it's fine anyway uh yeah i'm just gonna sit here and enjoy this browse on the gram for a little bit and then i have to get gas too so i'm gonna do that but I'm happy with my drink and and this is a drink they can't mess up like I tell the exact order like I went in a grande cup uh, vanilla sweet cream cold foam three pumps of vanilla and a triple espresso shot so they cannot mess this one up and like with measurements and everything so I'm happy about that Hello. Valerie, I yes. love the outfit. Yes. Yeah, as you can see, she's lost some weight. Leave in the comments. <laughs> she's lost, what, 20 pounds? Close to 30. Nice. And finally, it's been so long since we've had the salmon meal, so I had to vlog this, part of the week in the life. But I'll show you guys once it's done. There's Sherry. And here, my friends, is the salmon itself. It smells so good. All right, guys, got the coffee and we're ready to conquer this Thursday. So on my way to work and it's kind of busy at work now because the primary elections are coming up and basically I have to cut out like all these candidates heads, which there's more coming, which I'm so excited about. I wish that it was like a requirement because like, as you guys know, I don't know if you guys know this, but Valerie ran for Congress and stuff and it was a lot of work it was expensive too because like you have to campaign and like raise money and stuff so I wish it was a requirement just to add on to the requirements because I know kind of like both sides of it um, not really but kind of um it was a requirement to send like a PNG well not a PNG well yeah a PNG because then we could just change the format if need be a cutout of them like hire a graphic designer you know promote more jobs and then like submit it to like a national thing and then we could download them because that would make my life easier but it's fine because I listen to like music or like podcasts or whatever and I just like cut out all these heads and it's fine all right so I guess it's pretty much it for this clip I guess I'll just see you next time I pick up the camera and by the way, they made the drink perfect. Oh my gosh. When I see the shade, I know it's gonna be a good day. Okay, so on my way to Cycle Bar now, and I'm so excited. <laughs> my friend Angie works there now, which is so funny because like my friend London also worked at Cycle Bar. Um, she recently took like a new like full-time position somewhere. So, um, she doesn't work there anymore but now angie works there and it's just so funny because i feel like i've gotten a lot of people to like work there go there my friend was the one who got me like into cycle bar and like now i've gotten i think i've gotten my coworker to sign up she's not going to winter park though she's going to i think the lake nona one because it's like two minutes away from her house and then I got my hairstylist. Well, I don't know if I'm actually the one because I know her assistant also liked Cycle Bar, but I feel like I had some sort of impact on my hairstylist going there. And she goes to the um, Cycle Bar in Dr. Phillips. So even though they don't like really go to like mine, it's fine because they still like go, which I think is pretty cool. And now like Angie goes and she like works there now. Um, it's a good way to like build community and stuff and everything like that so i'm on my way now and I'm gonna film probably like more on my phone because it's easier even though i like all the footage to be on the camera and that was like a goal that i had for at least for this video so hopefully i won't forget to film the time lapse of me making my lunch because seriously like i was gonna film a time lapse of myself making my lunch yesterday and then i was like just lazy didn't but anyway I showed you guys I think on like Monday but anyway yeah I'm gonna get to driving now and yeah this is true a week in of my life and my thoughts and opinions 
so yeah okay so i was nervous that my trick wasn't working because i'm seeing all these people come out and and hold on i need to like fight for this spot oh my gosh okay i got it i got it yes okay so as you guys know my like trick to trying to get like a good spot everything and i'm like oh my gosh i'm gonna just have to succumb and like go into the parking garage which i don't like doing and it's not that big of a deal but anyway i'm just like holding it out like what time is it 6 25 like cutting it close to my like the actually like 6 30 mark because at 6 30 i'll just like park wherever like i don't care and i'll just like walk to the class finally i'm waiting 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 and unbeknownst to me the, this girl is walking and she like went to the prime parking spot like the front parking spot i got in and I, it was it was meant for me i'm so happy right now like you guys don't even know <laughs> I was like, okay, patience, patience, because, like, all these people are, like, leaving, and they're all in the garage, and I'm like, I don't want to be in the garage, so I'll just, like, wait it out, stick it out, and the reward paid off. Oh my gosh, I was on slow-mo for that last clip. Anyway, here's a little peek on our merch. So cute. My favorite one is the have a nice day. It's adorable. So. All right, so Sherry kindly made a salad for me. I love it when mother makes the salads because, well, I don't have to. <laughs> and I'm gonna finish this book tonight. That's my goal after I eat because like I can't read and eat, just can't do it. And yeah, it's like, nine o'clock at night and i hate eating this late but it's okay i only have eat this late like once a week because of cycle bar when i take the evening classes i know don't mind the hair i just finished the art of raising a puppy and i think i learned a lot about it and dogs in general if you guys are looking to get a dog and stuff i highly recommend this book it's kind of a long read but it really goes into like a lot of detail uh with the dogs and stuff and they include like pictures and i know like not every dog is the same and they all have like different temperaments but it's fine one thing i really didn't like about this book i even like underlined some stuff but um one thing I didn't like about this book, the font is just so tiny. So it did take me a while. Like, I think this book took me over two weeks to read, maybe even three weeks. Like, I don't really know because I didn't really read on the weekends, which I don't because I'm pretty busy. But yeah, um, it's like a 312 page book and I just completed it. And now I'm going to open my now i'm gonna open my new book which i'm so excited about i posted it on my instagram so this is the book it's by jeanette mccurdy and you guys probably know who jeanette is because if you know the show iCarly, she was like one of the main characters in that show but i got the hard copy i pre-ordered this it kind of sucks because i had to buy the hard copy because it just got released but i got a five dollar credit um like five dollars back on my card because i did pre-order so it only turned out to be like 20 bucks instead of 25 bucks but i can't wait to read this like i want to start reading it like now but it's already midnight pretty much so i need to like go to bed maybe i can take it to work tomorrow but i am pretty busy at work so maybe i can read it on my lunch break or something like that like start it but she just goes into like all the shady things that happened at nickelodeon her abusive mother and i don't know this book just seems like right up my alley like it's all like the subjects that i love like kind of darker topics but um it's true just everything like that i'm so excited to read this book Okay, so this is kind of random too. My forehead is so shiny. What I was gonna say also, I do like hardcover books because you don't really like see the cover and I honestly like books like this. It reminds me of the book emoji where like, you know, the books are like stacked on top of each other and like you can't see any cover. I don't know. I like the plain vibe, but that's just me. Also, new book smell, new book smell. Guys, this book smells so good <laughs> and like, I wish there was like a car scent for like new book smell because I would totally buy that anyway And I swear each book like has its own scent Well, this one kind of lost its scent because like I've had it for a while But like new book smell like new school book textbook 
Smell just is the best. Okay, now I officially have to get to bed because I'm gonna be tired tomorrow. But I already can tell that this book is gonna be like one that I cannot put down and I'm gonna probably read it like in two days because it's right up my alley like I was saying. So I'm so excited. Okay guys, so my forehead's still shiny. It's the next day, happy Friday. Hair is in a ponytail today because it's kind of gross, not gonna lie. I'm gonna wash it tomorrow. And then this is the outfit. It's supposed to be like really rainy today, at least starting at like three, four o'clock. And I have my little like cardigan there because it gets like super cold in the office. So I'm gonna wear that. Harry, yeah. happy yep. Friday. Oh, she's working on finances. Yeah, so it's on here, eight, 10. All right, so on the way to work, got my Starbucks. Their coffee's just so good. Even though Dunkin's is pretty good too, not gonna lie. Um, and then I always listen to YouTube videos because they're just like nicely kind of, I kind of treat them like podcasts now in a way. So yeah, we are on the road again. I'm all done with work and it's the weekend. I'm so excited. Tomorrow's gonna be super fun. I'm gonna start a new video, but Today was good. I finished up with the heads. I need to like rename some files though. So that'll be fun. Um, it's not that big of a deal. Like it's just renaming the photos I saved. So I had to save like in different formats. So there's this thing called Targa. Don't ask me like what it actually means or anything like that. Cause I don't know. I'm just doing what I'm told. And then another one was saving in TIFF, like .tif and it's kind of like a png but not really it's like a really older version of a png i guess it's like with transparency and stuff so that's what i did today mostly and then the news like stuff was um we're kind of busy we're pretty steady and stuff but with like the heads and everything like i thought we were busy because i was like oh my gosh gotta finish this because whenever i like start something like i want to finish it that day like it's my goal so yeah did that now i'm heading home it is spaghetti night I'm so excited and you know me i'm a sucker for pasta so I'll show you guys that. I was gonna edit this video tonight, but I didn't get a chance to read the Jeanette book as much as I wanted to. I'm on like page 22, but I'm probably gonna end up reading tonight again because that book is just so good. And I will like, kind of my goal is to finish it this week or this weekend because I know with like things at work and everything, it's gonna be picking up with the election and all that. So I'll be pretty busy. So, yeah i don't know when i'm gonna edit this video i'll probably edit this video after cycle bar tomorrow because i'm gonna go in the morning and then i'm actually gonna be coming back downtown to meet up with one of my friends because you know i left my water bottle in her car last weekend so i'm gonna have to pick that up and yeah so i will see you guys when i get home and i'll show you guys my dinner my pasta Okay, so I almost forgot to show you guys my meal, but just played pasta. And then my Brussels sprouts. I forgot to film that. But here's the mother's food. And it's just spaghetti and meatballs. Mm -hmm. 